So today I am preparing my potatoes for planting. I got some of these potatoes from Tractor Supply uh, potato starts and then some of them were actually organic potatoes that I bought from the grocery store that started to sprout and kind of got a little bit soft so they're no longer good to eat, but they're perfect for the garden. And so right now basically I'm cutting my potatoes up and making as many potato plants as I can. If you've got multiple sprouts coming out of your potato, you definitely want to cut them up. That way you can get as many as possible from each potato. So this one's only got one root, so I'm not going to cut this guy up. But uh, if I've got the ability to split it in half or cut it even into three or four uh, for, so that each little chunk has its own you know, sprout, then um, that's what I try to do. That way I can get as many as I possibly can. And so after I cut them up, then I'm gonna let them sit on the counter and scar up for a couple days. If you plant them directly in the soil like this, it makes them super susceptible to uh, getting diseases, rotting, molding, all sorts of stuff. So it's best to let them sit on the counter and harden it up a little bit. And then after about three days or four days, then planting them in the soil. And then once you get them ready to plant, then you're gonna to wanna to make sure you plant these sprouts facing upwards. Uh, these are actually not roots, but these are what's gonna become the potato plant that grows out of the soil. So yeah, you just wanna make sure that these, these roots right here grow upwards and not downwards um, because they will not come out of the soil. So I'm really excited to get these guys going. If you guys do not grow your own potatoes, you're seriously missing out. Homegrown potatoes are one of my absolute favorite things. They are so delicious, they're so um, tender, and just once you experience it, you don't ever want to get store pot, you know, store bought potatoes. But unfortunately, once you eat them all up, they're gone, and then you just have to wait until you can plant more. So, anywho, I'm excited to get these guys going. If you guys uh, plant your own for the first time this year, let me know how it goes. And uh, happy planting, guys.